With 19 starters back, UNLV will field a veteran group of Rebels for Bobby Houck's fourth season in Las Vegas. They're hungry uh, because of it. I don't, I don't think that uh, uh, it's been anything but motivating to our group. Uh, they want to win, and uh, I think that will uh, lend itself to, to us maybe getting that done this year. Everyone's bought in by now, you know what I mean? Like, it, no one's stuck in like the old ways and, of, of like doing things. It's enough, like it, it's just time, why, why not us? Tim Cornette will once again be one of the cornerstones of the Rebel offense after rushing for over 1,200 yards last season. His coach expects a landmark year out of his senior leader this fall. He's worked his way into being uh, more physical guy and obviously we're not a whole bunch of individual goals but we hope that he'll uh, set the career rushing record in the first half of the season. Quarterback Nick <laughs> Sherry will be back under center after a solid freshman season that saw him throw for over 2,500 yards and 16 touchdowns. He's extremely intelligent. Really wants to win. Like he's one of those type of guys that really wants to win. Even him being a redshirt sophomore, he's a guy that like the rest of the players like to look up to and like really be like, this is what we need. This is what we can't let him down. The Rebels are deep at wide receiver, led by a pair of juniors, Marcus Sullivan and Devontae Davis, who combined to catch 116 passes and eight touchdowns last fall. We've got some big targets. We've got some guys that can run a little bit. Uh, I do like uh, those groups mostly because they've played some. You know that we, they all played as, as freshmen for us, and, and we liked them as freshmen. But again, kind of like the quarterback, uh, the expectation is the level of play will increase, and, and they know the game better. They know what the, it takes to uh, to get ready for the season. So, uh, you know, I'm I'm as excited as any. Uh, just to see how far these guys have come. The Rebels have placed a big focus on improving the defense during the offseason, which will now be led by Bobby Houck's brother, Tim Houck, who inherits a defense that ranked ninth in the Mountain West in 2012. Defense and UNLV football have not exactly been synonymous uh, during that time. So we've, uh, we, when we got here, we had only had 16 guys, I think, in the front seven on defense on scholarship. It needed to be about double of that, so we've We've moved uh, forward in that, that regard, and uh, you know we've got we've got decent depth. Um, I, I think the strength right now on the defensive side of the ball is the linebackers. That's been our our main emphasis to to, to let a team know that you're not going to run the ball on us. So that that's been a big emphasis this summer, and um, more more film. You know, film study and stuff, people knowing where they need to be, because that's, that's pretty much the biggest thing, and stop the run, people being in the right place at the right time, knowing your gaps, everybody doing their 111. So that's been a big emphasis on really taking that next level as far as film, you know, film study and, and, and just knowing the game better, a lot more. UNLV opens up the season on the road at Minnesota. For the Mountain West Network, I'm Jesse Kurtz.